So by taking on these jobs, you get the reward and I get the practice. Right. Everybody wins. Well, except the monsters. Okay. Hit us with the details. Some monsters we've never seen before are lurking near a lake west of the Sea Haven. A lot of people depend on that lake for water, so those monsters have become a real nuisance. I'm looking for someone to exterminate the beasts. What's the reward? Cash, of course. You heard the woman. Thoughts? Sounds fine to me. Fighting monsters will be good training. Excellent. Now these beasts are no pushovers, so please watch yourselves. About your sword training, the monsters aren't just going to stand there like training dummies, you know? We should go over some basics first. I appreciate it. Ready your sword. Well, that'll do. You have my gratitude. Shall we go? Wait, Jude. Take a moment to consider your situation. You don't have to stay with me anymore, you know. Uh, right. Now that we've crossed the border, it'll be a while before any pursuers from Rashugal get here. What are you suggesting? Just that he still has some time to think things over. Sorry, I'll make up my mind by the time you set off. Okay, very well. Let's go and complete that request. You thought you were doing the right thing. Now you're on the run. That's a pretty tough lesson for a kid your age. Yeah. But I brought it upon myself. Let's see. What are you up to? Just trying to organize all of my notes for my thesis. Those in the books at a time like this? You sure are studious. Yeah, probably a waste of time. I'm sure I've already been expelled being an X-marked criminal and all. Ah, cheer up, kid. If I get a chance, I'll testify to the military and the school on your behalf. Shouldn't be hard to make the case that you're just a poor kid who got sucked into this. Thanks. But... Aren't you a wanted criminal, too? Ah, that. I guess I did flee along with you. So if we get captured, I'll testify for you. I'll tell them that you're nowhere near as shady as you look. <laughs> I'll take it as a compliment. shining. Mine too. Wait, you two have orbs too? Great! We should try linked combat. What's that? Lilium orbs are handy things. They let you sense your companion's intent. That's a huge advantage in battle. You can coordinate your thoughts to pull off combination attacks. We call this linking. Sounds great, but how do we do it? Try it and see for yourself. Focus your consciousness into the Lilium orb. Try linking up. So this is linking.
Okay, it's time to flank them. I can sense Jude's next movement. Hey, watch your back. I'll help. It's time to finish them off. I think you're ready to learn some linked arts. Born from cooperation and friendship. Not bad, right? Yes, I quite like it. I feel much better knowing I'm not fighting alone. <laughs> right there with you, buddy. Starting to look pretty good with that blade. Hmm. I do seem to possess an aptitude for sword fighting. Onward. Attack! Demon set! Demon set! Who's 
Smith. The name's Alvin. And don't you forget it. You forget it. Forget it. Yeah. 
we're supposed to get rid of. Indeed. They certainly don't look like the normal fauna for this area. All right. Let's get the job done. than an actual battle. You got that right. Let's head back to Alati Sea Haven and make a report.
far too easy.
Those monsters won't be tinkling in your water supply anymore. Wonderful. Thank you for your help. And that's how it's done. More where that came from, too. Lots of people with problems out there. And gall to make them go away. You're a real pro at this, Alvin. Hey! Hmm. No fever. How are you feeling? I don't seem to have any strength. Um, have you been eating properly? I've never eaten. Ever? Through Sylph, I drew life from the air. With Undine's power, I received sustenance from the water. What's she talking about? I guess the spirits gave her all the energy she needed. Well, now you're gonna have to nourish yourself the old-fashioned way. I see. So this is what you call hunger. <laughs> Fascinating. So, should we rest at the inn? Now that you mention it, I could use some grub myself.
was quite a sigh. So seriously, you guys are spying for Arjul, right? What? Of course not. I've never heard of the Military Powers Act being used against anyone other than Ajul spies. You're thinking too much into this! Why are you so concerned about this? Unless you're spying for Rashagol. No, no. I was just thinking that if you were spying for Ajul, maybe you could use your connections to score me some high-paying intelligence work. Sorry to disappoint you, but I assure you I will pay your fee. You just have to wait a little bit longer. Fair enough. But even with your special friend discount, the interest is piling up.